Today class, we'll be talking about what makes an effective work team. Oh, man, there's nothing up here. But let's forget about that. An effective work team is a team that works well uh, together to accomplish a goal. However, the group will work better together than individualistically. So they have to talk to each other and work together throughout it, whether that be in remote locations, the same locations, through internet, whatever that may be, they need to uh, know the goal and know how to accomplish the goal together. Okay, so you know when culinary school you have to write recipes, right? Yeah, I guess. I don't know. I'm not a baker. <laughs> I'm not a chef. All right. You want to learn how to be? Yeah, walk me through it. All right, gotcha. So first step. So let's say, what do you want to make? What's your favorite dish? Uh, let's go with mac and cheese. Got to be simple. It's easy. All right. So let's start off with uh, you obviously have your bechamel sauce. All right. That is. That's uh, that's gonna be your balloute with onions in it. So <laughs> yeah, you know what that means, right? And then your second step would be to uh, cook the noodles. Yeah, you don't want round noodles. No, you don't want round noodles. It tastes good. Yeah. Um, three. So this is just brainstorming, so we're going to have to, you know, just, this is just rough, rough draft, you know? Yeah. It's always going to change. And a lot of nice refined mac and cheese. For sure. For sure. And then, uh, so into the bechamel sauce, you're going to uh, add cheese, obviously, you want, you know, yeah. cheese in it, right? So then you combine all the ingredients, and then I would say bake it in an oven at 375. For how long? Because uh, I don't want it to burn. I would say, well, it's, it's, to, it's to the look of it, but I would say if you're going to want time, I'd say like 30 minutes. 30 minutes. Yeah. And have a nice mac and cheese. Yeah. Any questions? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, what if I don't want mac and cheese? What if I want something else? Um, I don't know. I didn't, I didn't really think of that. You asked me. <laughs> you asked me what, what I wanted. What if I wanted a potato salad? You were ended up with mac and cheese. I, I guess we could do potato salad. Yeah, forget this. Yeah, forget this. Hey, what's going on in here? What was that all about? Just erasing this stuff. I didn't want mac and cheese. Why well, stop being an effective team member? It sure is. Is that? Come on. This is about me. This isn't about him. It's about it's me. It's your group. you got to come up with two ideas. If you want potato salad and he wants mac and cheese, brainstorm on both so you can make a meal together. He's using big words. No, no. Potato salad, much easier. It is easier, but you got to come up with a happy medium. Make a little of both, a little of this, then get a full meal. There is no happy medium when I'm involved. Yes, you got to learn to compromise. Be an effective team member, a team player. No. I can't do it. You can do it. I know you can. Come on, man. Hey, I know you want a mac and cheese. I think we should work on this together. Yeah, I, I agree. It would have been nice if you would have, you know, not erased my stuff before we talked about it. But yeah, I know. I, no, that yeah. was my mistake. Yeah, I should have left it there. For sure, we got to get over it. We, we definitely need two dishes. Yes. So do you remember the mac and cheese recipe? There was some fancy sauce or something. Yeah, you guys yeah. are always so what, it up. What we should do, I, in my opinion, we can you know work on it together. But I think we should brainstorm your potato salad. Yeah, we because we do that. Because okay. okay. we already have. We have markers at work. You know, it'd be a good place. You know, we'll, we'll remove this eraser anyway. Yeah, it sounds like a good idea. All right. So first, you're gonna you know obviously boil your potatoes, or you can you know do them in a in on a sheet pan in the convection oven. Right. So then we'll you're use gonna, the Tucker Tucker taters too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Sure. Stay local. Sure. Yeah. And then we can, uh, you know, have your carrots, onions, mm -hmm. yeah. celery, all the good stuff. Yeah. Some celery. Put some bacon uh, in there too. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. That sounds great. Uh, Old Bay seasoning. We could do. But you know what? We can't forget about the mac and cheese. Yeah, for sure. That's that Definitely. is what's really important. Now. Yeah. I appreciate that you respect that and that we're brainstorming this together. Yeah, this is this feels right. Yeah, it, feels it does. Like we should have done this before. It does. And so we'll cut it there and then we'll do a uh, mayonnaise as well. Yeah, and combine it all together. Exactly. Yeah, sounds good, man. We'll meet about it next week.
Dankeschön. Ja.